taking a quick assessment of our surroundings, you guys can tell that I'm part of an elite mobile task force. I've got some pretty impressive weaponry, automatic grenade launcher, and we're in an airplane, and we're about to paradrop into what can only be described to us in our briefing as paranormal activity? Even possibly cryptid activity? We need a paradrop into, I believe it's like a cult compound? You can start to see it now, sort of like becoming more visible. That looks more like a military base than a regular cult compound. They've got guard towers. They've got a helipad on the roof. They've got freaking radar. Oh, I landed in the tree. Don't worry, I'm a, I'm a professional, guys. This is fine. I don't know what we're up against. You, I was doing the mission briefing. I was hyping us up and you just set off the alarms, Bob. Bob, I'm gonna have to write you up, man. We're part of a mobile task force. We're supposed to be the elite of the elite and Bob's over here just like, you know what, I'm gonna just... Agent Sadler, heads up fee seven, unidentified helo inbound on your position. Well, that's pretty terrible news, given the fact that we're out in the relative open, or we need to cross the open. Guards up in the tower. Where's the helo? Oh, I can see the helo. If this thing is armed. Oh, it's armed. Guys, we gotta get out of here. We gotta get in the base. Oh my gosh. You're talking like guards and opposition, as well as air support. Wait, it might be landing on the top? Uh, it, it might be dropping in more troops. It's, you may think it's spraying and praying, but it's strafing and crafing. And I don't know what that word means, but I wanted it to rhyme, okay? Ooh, snap. V7, we have friendly gunship support on its way. Now that's what I'm talking about. We need some air support. So stand by, we've cleared out like the outer section, but this helicopter's gonna tear us up if it's allowed any more time up there. Oh, anti-aircraft fire. It's an Apache! Oh, heck yes. What kind of cult has a military-grade helicopter with a minigun on the side? Now that is what I'm talking about. Oh, snap. Those guys look like Spec Ops troops themselves. Operatives? We got laser sights. There's guards. The operatives look... Like, look at these guys. Who are these guys? This is freaking intense. The Apache just took down the enemy gunship and we're in here. I think there's some anti-aircraft fire going up at the Apache though. I'm not entirely sure where it is. So we just gotta make our way into the inner bit of the compound. Oh, it's definitely taking ground fire from like right over here. Let's see if I can not silence that. Tons of guards. Wait a minute. There's some better shooting. I just feel like we were not prepped for this mission. Like our commanding officers weren't like entirely honest with us. Gotta love air support though. What? What would a compound that this, that is this heavily defended be guarding? Oh my gosh, air support, you are reading my mind. All right, secure this area. Well, the compound secure, okay, that answers that. Check the main offices. I really wonder what's in that bunker over there. Where's everybody that's supposed to be like working here or living here? Uh, guys, this is creepy. Just find the offices and let's just, let's just get out of here as soon as possible. Got another floor, but there is a hallway to check. This looks like a CEO type office right here. What? And they do have some stuff left over. Should allow us access into the underground section. Uh, they said a lot of movement in the compound and that was the creepiest sound that I've heard. I have chills. Oh! Guys, I need help here. Unknown? Jeez. Wait, there's more? What is that? It's definitely cryptid in form and potentially even in nature. Uh, so that's probably the source of all the movement. That would make sense. Is that what they're hiding in the bunker over there? Do I dare explore the top? Yes. Oh, more movement. Uh, that is a lot. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, they're coming here. I'm glad they loaded me with this thing. Guys, they're about to be coming out these doors. We're gonna hold them here on the rooftop? Oh, they're gonna be coming from right here. Oh, oh my gosh. This is like an apocalypse. Luckily, they don't have weapons, nor do they know how to use them other than what I would imagine is just like their arms or mandibles or whatever you call them to do blunt force trauma. Uh, eventually, we're gonna have to get down these stairs though. Let's reload this beauty. Guys, everybody down here, like you, you gotta lead the way. <laughs> While I'm reloading my grenade launcher, man, I don't want to die in the middle of reloading. This is in Counter-Strike. So that was like, what, two waves of those things. Just gotta get out of this compound. You can see how much damage those grenade launchers did. Whoa. Okay, good. A little bit of ammo. 210 it is. 
That's good enough. Everyone in the MTF is still alive. We've encountered guards. We've encountered some operatives that were dropped off on the rooftop via helicopter. As soon as the alarm went off, that was some like quick response. There might be some, a base around here, but I mean, that kind of goes outside of the parameters of this mission. I got the key card. Now it's time to open this vault. I just have a bad feeling about this. What are you shooting at? Oh my gosh, it's an ambush? Are they gonna, oh! Oh God. Oh, this is bad. Oh my gosh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. We've gotta go down. I thought there was one more, but it's just this one rolling down the ramp. Going down means we're gonna be in tunnels and caverns and stuff, which means escape is going to be rather limited. I don't enjoy this, but I did sign up for this to be part of, oh my God. Oh, reload faster. And from the top. Luckily they got the top, well, more or less secured, right? Jeez. I mean, at this point, we're down to our last two magazines and a few extra rounds. I'm gonna need to salvage some. I do have my sidearm, but you know, with, with nine rounds in a mag, that's, that doesn't feel like it's enough. Why is there a 50 cal aimed at the door? Yes. There's a lot of cover they can use. Thank God someone put a 50 cal right here. Modus indeed, my friend. Thank you so much. I would kiss you if I could. Everybody get extra rounds. We're gonna need them. Um, and then I guess, oh great. We're gonna go deeper, aren't we? <laughs> we need to go deeper. Not the loud siren. Everybody get, everybody get here. What? It, you're supposed to be elite. Uh-oh, um, am I facing the wrong way or the right way? Okay, oh, there we go. Close confines grenades, man. This thing is amazing. Guys, there's one, you're looking the wrong way. There's one right there. One of you needs to do the job. I need to know you can. Thank goodness, who recruited you? I did. It's just like, everywhere's a freaking ambush. All right, screw that, you know the deal. Grenades. The obvious conclusion is to follow the arrows, right? And they point this way. Just get in, get out. Uh, oh my gosh, they're coming from behind us because of course they are. Oh goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait a minute. That is a key card. Should grant you access into the excavation site? Are you telling me we dug too deep and found those? Oh god. Oh, those are operatives. Where were they this whole time? So the objective, secure the compound, did that. Remain undetected. <laughs> That's funny. Search for evidence and investigate the underground section. I mean, is the evidence just the fact that we found like an army of monsters? Is there ammunition anywhere in here? I'm down to my last mag and a third. I'm gonna have to switch to pistols. Who do you work for? I should have interrogated them before I filled them with bullets, but you know, check your corners. Okay, yeah, that's a giant red vault door. Is this, like, I just feel that if I walk through this door, they're gonna attack me from all sides again, which I don't think I wanna experience that. Guard our six. Oh my, oh, oh my. This isn't like a normal cult. This is military grade like tunneling. Unless it was here before. What's that sound? Oh my God, that doesn't bode well. There's some weird growths, tumor brain like growths with a some kind of like umbilical growth. That's our target and it's popping out stuff. Guys, wait a minute. Oh no. Oh geez, it's a little one. Uh, tactical retreat. Bravely, bravely, bravely running away. This pistol, man, I need like more bullets. This is not good, this is not good. God. Someone drop ammunition, why does everyone have help? This isn't gonna work. We're gonna have to try something else. I'm just gonna run by them. This is not good. I need ammunition badly. Please tell me there's some here. What is this? Oh my God, there is ammo. What is the sphere? From the sphere. Uh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Screw it, we're using grenades. Did that kill it? Oh, oh, I kill it, it's called unknown. Two grenades each. That seems to blow up these like egg sacs. Maybe it'll stop them from spawning. Is that all of them? Just keep running, don't die. Wait, they keep spawning out of this? 
I'm gonna tr Do I hit the sphere? Do I hit the base? What is that? Oh, that's gross. Oh, that's gross. It stopped its breathing. V7, what's happening? Massive ontokinetic disturbance? Evac to the surface now. <gasps> Did you see that? There's some weird, like, tentacle things coming out of that. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm going night vision. I can't see anything. It's just, it's just blackening everything. Is that my night vision stuff? Like, why can I see part of my body? Uh, I'm having an out-of-body experience right now. None of them seem to be exhibiting this. This could be in my head. The blue arrow. Here's the lift. I'm hoping in the sunlight, the, this, like, everybody better be here, because, like, I'm sorry, but I can't wait. I almost can't see anything. Wait a minute. I think, holy crap, I think I see the surface. Uh, what is that? I think I've been poisoned or something. I gotta get out of here, that thing is really, where did that come from? It looks like a giant like tooth. All right, I've made it out. And there's just like a line of tanks opening up. Uh, the extraction helo is inbound, ETA is two minutes. I don't know what this is, but nothing that these tanks or Apache gunships or these mobile artillery is doing to this thing. Oh no. Oh no, they're coming. Guys, you need to redirect your fire from up there down. Oh, this is bad. We're gonna get overrun, I think. Unknown. Why are they unknown? Why do we not know what is causing all this? Jeez. I'm in the middle of battle between man and something from another realm another dimension like under the ground i don't know i'm just a soldier man i'm not, I'm not this is above my pay grade i'm gonna try to grenade it and see what happens though come on something dented i can see the explosions wait are they behind us too we just gotta hold out for two minutes well then i guess that's what we're gonna do extraction helo has entered the area uh where 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 i'm seeing it on the radar Guys, cover my old six o'clock here. Helicopter's approaching. We got this tree line that's interfering, man. I just need to get out of here. I'm thankful for the reinforcements, making this a whole lot more bearable. There it is. All right, all right, pick us up, please, 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 please get me out of here. Someone needs to tell me what it is that I'm fighting and why. All right, we are Oscar Mike. Oh my gosh. Spec Ops boys on the miniguns. This guy just chilling here like, yeah, man, I I've seen some stuff, but I'm okay. I'm fine. What on earth? Or out? Oh my god, we nuked it. Oh my god, we nuked it. Holy crap. What? 